I gotta vent about gender norms for a sec. I've been a stay-at-home mom since my son was eight weeks old. He has an older sister, a younger sister. I have never denied his request to participate with us when we were doing our hair, our makeup, our nails. Such as my husband has never denied either girl child their request to go hunting or fishing. Over the weekend, we were visiting some relatives. My sister-in-law was doing her nails with my older and my younger daughter. Now, even though my son has participated in creative play with makeup and nail polish, he knows that society does not deem it appropriate for boys to wear that stuff out in public. So he's always taken it off before he left the house. So my sister-in-law pulls out all these fun nail polishes she has. My son watches her bond and have fun with my two daughters over painting their nails. So he asks if he's allowed to join them. Of course, the answer is always yes. When he was finished, he came to show me and wouldn't you know it, he picked the exact same color my nails happen to be painted. I cannot even explain to you the excitement this brought him that he happened to match his mom. Now he did decide to keep the nail polish on for the family get together. Just so happens that an older relative did make a comment. He made the comment that he thought my son was joking about wanting to paint his nails. My son replied, no, I was being serious. The relative then says, well, you need to take that off. I was ready to jump in, but I teach my kids to stand up for themselves and what makes them comfortable. So I waited to see how my son would react. Without skipping a beat, he said, no, I'm not gonna take it off. I like it. And at that, the relative walked away. First of all, I don't care who you are. You don't tell my child what they need to do with their body. Second of all, who made these rules up? Why would my girls wanna go hunting or fishing? That's so cool that these girls wanna get dirty and they're well-rounded and they know how to do things. And that's so great that their dad wants to bond with them. But if a mom tries to bond with her male child and something that she enjoys, unacceptable. Not gonna lie, people have made very nasty comments to me about my son liking musical theater. He is eight years old. Let him like what he wants to like. Take a sip of my coffee and get heated. I'm gonna tell you something, okay? My husband also had a mother that allowed him to enjoy the creative play of makeup, nails, even wearing dresses still knocks my socks off every night. Seriously though, my husband is so outdoorsy and like survival man. He can hunt, fish, build us a literal shelter if need be. But he also knows how to braid our daughter's hair and paint their nails and help them wear cute dresses. Let children scratch that. Let people enjoy things. Didn't we all just go through like a worldwide pandemic and things got real freaking scary for a while? Why are we taking away things that bring people joy? Shouldn't the moral of this entire pandemic be to bring people closer and allow people to live the lives they want? No, we're too worried about an eight-year-old boy painting his fingernails. It is absolute bull crap. But I am so proud of my son for standing up for himself. An eight-year-old stood up to a grown man who he barely sees and said, I'm gonna do what I want, it's my body. And if you don't think trans individuals deserve a place and a voice in this world, kindly see yourself off my page. We're changing things.